Okay, well here we are today uh, under the auspices of the Speaker's Corner Trust. Um, this is the area that we're going to dedicate for um, public speaking in Newcastle under Lyme. So I'm going to start with a piece to, to this camera now. Hopefully it'll be able to pick up the sound. This is what's called a sworn affidavit creating reborn men's trust. The straw man and government legal fiction formerly known as Alan Peter Michael Smith. Date of birth 1810-57. National insurance number WM86 5758D. Born Stoke-on-Trent, Staffordshire, England. Father Joseph Bernard Smith, mother Ermgard Bremer. Made this day 5th of June 2012 first principle for the preamble liberating overriding universal principle I hold that all individuals have the right to exercise sole dominion and control over their own livelihoods and livelihood as long as they do not forcibly interfere with the equal right of others to live in whatever manner they choose and that we enforce the law evenly without fear or favor under common law jurisdiction within a public court of record that's it you either believe and intend to live your life according to this guiding principle, or you do not. The difficulty with first principles is that they are inviolate. One either believes in them, or one does not. Once you adopt one, you are then forced to square all your other principles, political, against this first one. And if you cannot fit what you wish to adopt into that first principle, then you must modify or abandon whatever it was that you intended to do. Preamble, section one. Notification to protagonists. So with this affidavit do I, Peter Smith, hereby make a public oh, written and vocal declaration of my free man status and make notification to the Church of Rome, to all Vatican officials, priests and all its papists, clergy, to the Church of England, the Queen of England, defender of the Catholic faith, and the House of Windsor PLC, and to all monarchies, all presidents of republics and other bodies on these global isles to all Prime Ministers, all Ministers of States, Civil Servants, Crown Agents, Secretaries of State and Foreign Secretaries of the Commonwealth, to all Members of Parliament and Congress, elected or unelected, or operating via NGOs or as advisors in committees, to all Crown Agents and other employees of the Crown, being the Crown of the Holy Roman Empire, as well as the Crown of the Monarch of the United Kingdom acting as CEO to all members and representatives of bar councils and law societies, including the Lord Chancellor and the Attorney General, to all police forces, policemen and their commanders, including the Association of Chief of Police Officers, a private limited corporation, and to all military commanders and footmen and personnel, to the Rothschild family, as well as the Rothschild-controlled and funded Imperial clandestine Israel, the hand in the global fist, and all other military junters feigning allegiance to the people, no matter under which governmental flag they profess to walk beneath or supranational entity they profess to represent. To all governments, whether de facto or de jure, to all alphabet agencies of the global controlling elite, such as the NSA, CIA, FBI, TSA, MI5, MI6, FDA, BBC, ABC, NBC, ITV, as well as to all other appointed or self-appointed authority figures, would-be world dictators, cabals operating covertly and overtly against me, or business leaders as well as judges in courts and their henchmen, or attorney generals and judges in their courts who operate tribunals, courts as kangaroo courts operating under unified commercial code, admiralty law and all unlawfully at that, to all those bodies acting under the guise of legitimacy or parasitic banking cartel boards of directors as well as the boards of the Seven Sisters Oil Cartel and its OPEC front to all mandarins of business in food, pharmaceutical energy and the military industrial corporatocracy, masquerading as legitimate and friendly intention towards the people, to all known and unknown slave masters trading in people, governments everywhere in effect, to all federal banks and national banks and Western democratic governments under the influence of the Rothschild global control agenda for world domination and the others with which they work to all other despots and tyrants who purport to lead and govern and advise me and to offer services or try and collect money forcibly from me without written contract under common law so signed, all organized crime bosses and their gangs, drug cartels, triad gangs, mafias and hoods. To all the above I say you obtain your so-called authority via sham rigged democratic circuses, which are in effect elective dictatorships and of no good for the people. 
to you all do I announce the reawakening of myself and make declaration publicly here now that I have been gifted by my life, God, with a newfound clarity and understanding of the point and purpose of my sojourn here on this beautiful planet. I declare that I am now awake and fully aware as to your objectives, plans, methods, intents and deceits prepared as traps for me in my formerly naive but trusting and well-meaning state. Henceforth, thanks to my awakening and this public declaration of former naivety, I claim that all that should have been done is now done, non pro tonk, and that all which should have been now is. And I declare that my previous condition is now replaced by grace of my good self and newly acquired knowledge, and that from here on in, before any action, regime, law, provision, requirement, tax, levy or demand or restriction, can be imposed upon me, then it can only be done with my fully informed consent and my tacit verbal or written agreement, and that is the basic initial requirement. I further declare that should the redress I seek not be broadcast as I demand via global terrestrial and satellite networks via the BBC lead head station within 30 calendar days from the date of submission of this affidavit, then I will seek refuge in a safer kind of place on this planet. Regardless, I will now make a full and informed renunciation of my acquiescence and previously lazy acceptance of the controlling and limited belief systems of slavery, oppression, cruelty and mind control which you have forced upon me by the system's political and media trickery, treachery, lies and false promises as well as overt, secret and covert activities by the global corporatocracy whom by representing life in this world as a level playing field fair to and for all men when it was none other than a stacked deck of crony capitalism operating on a full service to self agenda, have now relinquished all rights to their assets and position and will be answerable to a jury of their peers in a common law court of record duly convened. Section two, demand for public acknowledgement of my declaration of entitlement to my inalienable rights as set out in this charter sought within 30 calendar days. I, the former legal fiction entity, legal presumption and straw man known as Alan Peter Michael Smith, do hereby rescind that title and assert my rights under common law to be now known simply as Peter of England. I declare that I adhere to and accept fully the REIT Movements Charter, which states and which should be publicly broadcast via media networks as follows. I, Peter of the family Smith, sue I juris, a flesh and blood man and blessed living soul serving God alone, do hereby affirm the following is my statement of truth. A. Whereas I, as a free man, and other members believing in world freedom and people's rights to self-determination with an open and transparent non-secretive society of common fellowship, challenge the cult of the omnipotent corporatocracy, military-industrial banking complex and state, and defend the rights of the individual. Whereas I hold B. Whereas I hold that all individuals have the right to exercise sole dominion over their own lives and have the right to live in whatever man they, manner they choose as long as they do not forcibly interfere with the equal right of others to live in whatever manner they choose, and that we enforce the law evenly, without fear or favour,